I am so fucking tired. So tired. Okay. I I is tired. I I is tired. Let me get my Sims 3 running. Ugh. I feel it in my eyes. I noticed it at work, you know? It's just they, they feel tired, I guess. Wait, where's my... There it is. Perfect. Hi, Kaysen. Hi, Reticles. Oop, this is falling. There we go. Got it. Also, wrong tilt. Gosh, I need to not have a jank setup, guys. Everything's just freaking thrown together. It's so bad. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I'm only semi-professional, right? TikTok. Okay, that's up. That should be working. Okay. Refresh these. Whoopsies. Why is my camera... Oh, whatever. I don't care right now. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Okay. Move that over there. Hi, Plumquat. How are you? Simmon time. There. Ah, it's so beautiful. Just what we needed. My day was good, Plum. It was good. I wish it was a little bit more productive, but that's okay. What is this? OMG. Holy crap, I can't spell tonight. I'm so freaking tired. I'm ready to throw some ragers. I know we la ended last night on a good, on an absolute rager. My desk is getting messy again. I have all these little Lego things on the desk. So many things. Oh my gosh, you guys. I need to start cleaning all over again. There's so many. I'm just, I think I just keep collecting things. Hi, Erica. Hi, Jose and Math. Welcome back, everybody. I also have had like five or six of these. I actually lost count. I don't remember now, but they're so good. These little Skittles. Oh, they're so yummy, you guys. Mmm. Skittles. Ding dongs. Yeah, I don't really eat those. I don't think I do. Little Debbie, right? Does Little Debbie make those or Hostess? Who makes those? Is that the alien I hear? Let me see. Oh my gosh, game, please. Seriously, I swear. You can't even I don't even I don't even know if you guys can feel the delay here. Oh my gosh, look at this. You you've got to be able to see this. Please, it's always the initial. It's always when the game first starts up. Holy crap. I'm just trying, thank you. I don't know why it does that. Why it like hangs for like a minute there. Definitely something technical. Part of the optimization list. Something that, that EA needs to fix. I don't know what it is. Something. No idea what it's related to. Maybe it's because it's like loading everything all at once. Not, I don't know. I don't freaking know. Look at the alien. So chocolatey. Yeah, sounds yummy. I actually bought a lot of snacks, but I was... I was going to eat them and try them all on stream tonight, but you know what? Better, better, maybe tomorrow, maybe tomorrow. I bought 
because I did a little target. I had a target snack haul there. I took a picture of earlier today when I was at work, and um, I'm thinking we'll just try it maybe tomorrow. Um, I got regular Lindor truffles, but then I got oat milk, the oat based ones that are regular chocolate uh, truffles, but they're just just oat. And then I bought one of these, and then I also bought. What did I buy? I know I bought a thing of ice cream, Skittles, chocolate truffles. Oh, there's two new Feastable flavors. None of them are the Creamy Beast that I suggested. It's the Cookies and Cream and Dark Chocolate. At least the Cookies and Cream. We're getting somewhere. At least there's now an official replacement for the Hershey bar. The Hershey's, you know, Cookies and Cream. At least there's one that's actually going to probably be better. I imagine. So... What are they, Jose? Wait, what? What is it? Lunch, lunch, lunchlies. What are these? Do I have to look this up? I'm gonna do it. Hang on, Jose. I've never heard of these. Is it like a better lunchable that doesn't have lead in it? Let's see. That's why I won't buy lunchables anymore. Apparently, there's lead in it. That's what I heard. Where would you find these? This place called Little Spoon. Is it Lunchly's? Is that really right? Is that how you spell it? Or is it Lunchers? I found Lunchers. Wait, I want to make sure I got this right. By Little Spoon, right? <laughs> Erica literally same because all I could think about was that time when I'm I was like just even a few years this is like this is like 2018 I was like obsessing over where is another another alien oh no it's oh it's the same one she's just walking by again it's so weird because the sound of the alien doesn't play off of the alien it plays off of the um the lights above in the sky but anyway anyways um you can sense my camera was zoomed out um no, honestly, Erica, I was literally obsessed with the chicken dunkers. I'm sure it's like low quality meat. I don't care. Th those chicken dunkers were so freaking good. I miss them. I even still miss them. I occasionally look for them at Walmarts, but then I'll, I just remember and I'm like, dude, <laughs> just leave the garbage out of the food. I don't know. I don't get it. It's not that hard. Weird. Really? What did it say anything or did it just, in just instantly ended? That's so weird. I know, right, Math? I think it's ingrained in Dorito's DNA. <gasps> Report card. Don't be nervous, Dorito. You got on that Dean's list. What a perfect A. Lara, thank you for the rose. There is a. Huh. Lynchly. Literally, Plumquat. But see, yeah, I guess it does. Let me look it up. Okay, well, I found something called um, Little Spoon. So, Jose, another spot for us to look into. Just saying, just saying. Lunchly.com, as you said. Let's see. Oh, this actually, there's two different websites. Would you look at that? Oh, but they included Prime, which I guess isn't terrible. But it could, it's not, it's not, it's not a perfect product. Feastables seems to be clean, I will say. When I scan the Feastables candy, I mean, there's, there's hardly any ingredients in it. So the ingredients that it has is good. However, that cheese be looking good from the nacho cheese. Where's the chicken? And where's where's the dessert? You Oh, I guess it's the Feastables. I'm imagining cookies. I want cookies. I don't want just a chocolate bar. I want the cookies. You know? Hi, Alondra. Huh. That's really weird why it instantly refunded. Was there... Huh. Does it cost you diamonds to do it, or does it, pay, does it charge you directly monies? How does that work? Because for me... For me, it usually just costs me monies. Glowberry Prime. What flavor is that? Uh, Simon? Is it si Simone? Welcome to the stream. Hello, welcome back. Thanks, Amanda. It's just a it's just a little place we rented in um university. Which honestly, this would be a fun house to live live in. 
Oh, that's interesting. Huh. I don't know, you could pay with diamonds. That's actually kind of cool. A uh, Starburst? Of course. Yeah, Math. Oh, yeah, those are good. I love those. Hi, Sav. Welcome back. Yeah, for sure, Red, naturally. That's really weird. <gasps> Sour apple. Oh, stop it, Jose. I'm going to have to get that. Wait, what? what is it, Amanda? What would you definitely get? Okay, hang on. Hang on, let me check. No way, Math. I don't believe it. I'm going to look it up. Starburst, there's no way they're going to stop making those. There's no freaking shot. Yeah, the house is very cute. I do agree. I almost actually, to be honest with you, Amanda, I kind of want to um, remake it in Sunset Valley and live in it. Low key. Um, yeah, okay, hang on. Where is this? Huh. So weird that it ended. Five minutes ago? Yeah, literally we started and then instantly stopped. It doesn't tell me anything. Wait, what, is that just, what did that just say? What the fuck is that? Alright. I probably have to restart this now, of course. Nicole, thank you for the heart, me, you guys. How are you, Nicole? I'm, I'm back. We should be good. Maybe it's just temperamental uh, red. The fuck? I am tired. Just a heads up. Yeah, we're good. Yep, my face. I can confirm my face is moving. I think this is the last day. We might as well throw another rager. A daytime rager? Why not? I know we just had one last night to celebrate our A's. I think we need to celebrate again, you guys. Game, why do you do why do you do that? Look it. Sometimes when you click on this, it flips them. Is it random or some shit? What why? What makes it different? Sometimes NRAS is on the bottom. Sometimes it's on to oh wait, when I do this. That's the only time it refreshes. If I click out here, then this now gets refreshed and there's a chance that cleanup will be at the bottom. But if I just keep spamming it, it's cleanup stains on top. But if I were to click on a chair and then click on this, right there, this, yeah, there we go. Now NRS is on top. See? Do you know how confusing that is? I noticed that. I've, no I've been noticing that occasionally. Oh, am I leaving? Graduation, I guess. I would rather be partying. It's fine. Hi, Gamer Grill. Welcome back. And hi, Ichiro. Hey, Snow. Good after morning. Um, okay. So... Well, I, I appreciate you enjoying the streams while getting ready in the morning. I'm saying that specifically because your name is showing up as, like, tons of little boxes on my screen. So I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of weird. That's just how it looks up on my phone or my um, my computer. So, But happy to have you on here. Glad you're enjoying it. Actually, what time is it for you, then, if it's morning for you? Aw, Nicole. Yeah, I wonder how long that'll take. Did you pay with did you pay with diamonds or direct money? Cuz that I'm wondering how long that takes. That might be something that could take like a day or so. I even feel like I feel like it might even be a little longer. That's just my I'm just guessing. I'm literally just guessing. Could be completely wrong. Oh, coins? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, my people. There we go. As long as I get in there. At least we get free um this stuff. This all starts going up. Look at that. No one's dying in, in, uh, while they're getting this. Yeah, you know, what is it? You, you know, yeah. Graduation. No one's dying here. I don't know, can people die in university? There has to be a Grim Reaper. Do you think the Grim Reaper looks different? 
like across do you think there's an easter egg where they he might look different or dress different in other areas i wonder like if different worlds could change his outfit now i'm curious i'm gonna have to have a sim die in every single world and see what happens now i'm curious i am going to write that idea down because i'm going to come back to that <laughs> let's see where is it Um, my typing is absolutely horrendous today. It usually isn't the greatest anyway, but Fred, thank you for the hand hearts. What's this? Oh, another degree cherry. I guess instead of being rebellious, we're now going to be handy. I'm just going down. I'm going to randomize it every time. Hmm. Denmark. Oh, wow. That's so wild. 7 a.m. Well, yes, good morning to you. <laughs> we don't have time for another party, unfortunately, guys. We spent our day at graduation. Thank you for the heart poofies. Uh, it's your great question. We are currently sitting on three of them. I think there might be six or seven, right? I think seven. I want to say there's like seven of them. When I come back, I'm renting this house again. I need to sell stuff, this stuff. Spider web work. Yeah, that can go. It's a dollar. Ooh, that's a oh, whole my monies. I should have asked for more money. Hi, Miriam, and hi, Kaylee. But we did spend some money on all our, our, our party equipment. Just you guys wait. I'm going to actually... I'll clean this up. Actually, I'm going to clean it up. Get ready, guys. We're going to start a brand new degree tonight. And we're going to be throwing some parties. I like how the appliance just disappears. One hour. Holy crap. These drawings really do like gain value. It's kind of nice. They start this one started out at seven dollars and it appreciated to forty three. Like it's cool to it's cool to see that. I should really let him draw more. Oh, we don't have time to go on a date right now. I feel like I should take some of the stuff with me back home. Oh, we leave at nine. It's just a waiting game. He, him, Blake. I just like to look feminine. Oh, what the hell? I think my phone's dying. Oh. Oh, I forgot to plug it in. Wait, where's my charger? Oh, my gosh. That's what I forgot to do. Son of a bitch. See, I'm too tired, guys. Mother effer. I can't do this. I'm way too tired for this. Oh, Blake, you're so sweet. Stop it. Well, thank you. So are you. I just need to wait for my phone to start back up again. I'm plugging this bad boy into the iPad charger. Fuck this. BRB. Come on. Alright guys, give me a smidge. 
I and now have to wait for my phone to supercharge. I just need to charge up for a little bit and then I'll get it back on. So very soon, very, very soon. I can't believe I forgot to plug in my phone. <laughs> That's okay. Ooh, term is over. I, can't, I wonder what our next degree is going to be. Honestly, communications, that one sucked. I did not enjoy that one. I just didn't like how we have to talk on the thing. Yes, Amanda, yes, we did do physical education. Yep. I'm not too familiar with it, to be honest with you, Blake. I don't really interact with many live streams, so I'm not sure how how it is for the user experience. Um, yeah. Is it just like weird getting the chat box up? I know it's easy to swipe out of streams, so just a heads up to you on that. Yes, yes, Gamer Girl, we did, um, we did do arts. Fine arts, I believe, was the first one. Interestingly, I started with the easiest one, which is actually probably the best, because um, we need to acquire money. And guys, university is a money printer. All you do is go to, all you do is sign up for the cheapest classes, okay? And then, then just constantly ask for money every day. It's super dumb. Red, thank you for the confettis. Oh, that's weird. Okay, that's really weird. Yeah, because I know this. You can, if you rotate your phone, the stream will rotate with it, and then if you go back to vertical, it'll it'll go to vertical. Can you like just? Can you just kind of? Can you rotate your phone sideways and then back to vertical? Does that help anything? I do. Yes. Um, my YouTube and my any other platforms is Justin Ride. Kaylee, that's a good point to you. Uh, exiting and rejoining could work. Achiro, not yet. We just got back. So pretty much we just um, did graduation, and now, for the second, the moment I'm going to be here, I'm literally going to have him leave. I'm going to save, and then have him leave. Okay, now we save. And then I'm going to do... Actually, I should do a save as. Hi, Kiki. Let's see. Save as. We'll call this University 4. And then we'll just save again. When we get over to the class. Okay. So we currently now have three degrees. No, Dorito, you don't want to sleep in that. It's a garbage bed. Okay, guys, so we have done physical education, communications, fine arts. There's actually six classes. Next up is science and medicine, then technology, and then business, which is probably going to be the most boring. Science and medicine it is. We're gonna do two terms, and we have to fill it up. Credits, 36. It's gonna be a lot. Yeah, we have to do the two terms. So then we come back and have two more to go, guys. Let's freaking go. I'm curious what science and medicine will be. I don't think I've ever taken this before. Oh, tech, okay. We're getting there, Amanda, we're getting there. Oh, it's becoming daytime here. Not that it really matters. 
I wonder if when I come back, it'll also it'll be 4.30. Yes, you see, it's 4.30 a.m., and it's only been, it's only on day two. So to Sunset Valley, I've only been here a day, and I have, like, a wealth of knowledge. Yes, yes, Kay, we're getting every single degree. That's the plan. All six. We have half of them. We've done three. So now we're starting the fourth one, which we're doing, I think it's, well, it's medicine and, is science and medicine, I think. <sighs> okay. I'm waiting for my phone to not be dead. I'm pretty sure I plugged it in, right? I think I definitely did. I for certainly did. Is it alive? It is. 6%. I don't know if that'll be enough to for it to work on its own. But I'm going to try it. <laughs> Damn it. I made a noob mistake. Turn my brightness all the way down. Low battery mode is on. And it's now being charged. All right, guys. We are almost back. You guys should be able to see me now. That's better. No, my phone doesn't overheat. This one just died because I didn't plug it in. But this, I, I've never had any overheating issues with my um, iPhone. I think the only time I've ever had an iPhone overheat was actually one of these. It was my iPhone 5, and it was because I was using it for directions, I think. But what I did was I stuck it. So, oh, hang on. This is the best part. I love it. I actually love that they gave us the intro every time. Thank you, Red, for the cheer squad. It's nice, because I don't think any other world does that. Even in World Adventures. They definitely should have done that. Because I can come back here more frequently than World Adventures, theoretically. Of course, once I've had every single degree, I don't know if I can. Then, then I don't think you ever come back. Wow, I'm getting poor. I'm going to have to ask the school for money again. Anyways, I would stick the phone in the vents of my car because the way the car was and the, the vent size and everything, I was able to just stick the phone there. It was just easier for me to do that. And it was it was like cold outside, so I was, I was using the heat in the car and then I wasn't really thinking about it. And then the phone eventually said it was overheating. And I was like, oh, whoops. But otherwise, no, I've never had iPhones where they were like just inherently overheating. I guess the last time... Actually, the last time something like that would happen, though, was the iPod Touch, the fourth generation, using FaceTime. I remember it overheating on FaceTime a lot. But, like, I shouldn't even say overheating. It gets hot, but I've no, no, I guess I should say I have not had an iPhone where it would actually have an overheating problem. So when we say overheating, are you guys saying, like, the phone would, like, turn itself off or would it would say, like, it would have to cool down? Like, is it when the phone tells you it needs to cool down? Because in that case, I haven't had it where I had consistent issues. The only times it happened was, I guess, the fourth generation iPod Touch. I think occasionally. And then that would be it. That's the only device I've ever had that probably happen. Yeah, no, that's crazy. So you're saying the 13, I've definitely heard about... I've heard the 13s doing that. I've definitely heard about that. Oh, hi, Abby. What's up? Also, Blake, thank you for the follow. Officially welcome back. You remembered the name, and I'm glad it worked. So you fixed it by the red. Thank you, by the way, for all the gifties as well. Oh, my gosh. It's okay. I believe in you. You can do this. Your math and German test, you got this, okay? We believe in you. I have. Yes, Amanda. I've lived in dorms and frats, but I'm purposely doing this because the game gets ex extra laggy in a frat house, or I guess in any dorm, and it's just... So I'm trying to avoid the lag, essentially. Aw, give Carol a friendly hug. Maybe on our next party. We have orientation at 12, so after orientation, I'm throwing in a rager. In fact... I'm going to schedule the party now. We're having an absolute rager, guys, to get ready for the whole week. Aw, thank you, Blake. Happy to have you on here with us. Um, I do a lot of sims, usually, so if you're... Yeah, I welcome you to 
hang with us. PM, we're going to do a 7, 8, 8 PM. Let's do that. Casual. We'll invite all our buddies first. Look, guys, we're, we're getting more friends. Coworkers. Oh, that's it. We've maxed it out. Sweet. So it'll start at 8 p.m. Perfect. Order pizza. Actually, bet. I'm going to do that. Wait a minute. Hang on, guys. I need to research. Science and medicine. So what do I need to know? So science students gain academic performance when improving their science gardening, or fishing skills. Well, 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 that's right up Dorito's alley. Working with anatomy skeleton will also help increase their academic performance. Well, good thing Dorito is an angler, isn't he? He sure is. I'm wondering if having this this trait might super boost the, the thingies. So, yeah. Hi, Victoria. Um, also, Abby, I'm not sure if you're still there, but uh, if you said anything else after that, I didn't see your comment otherwise. Just to check in on you there. Oh yeah, the radios too. I know it's kind of fun though. It's annoying. It is. It can be actually stressful though. All the sounds going off. They're a great party. I'm gonna try that. Give Carol a friendly hug. Improve cooking. How far is my cooking level actually? Pretty far. Pizza sooner. Pizza is sooner. We'll just do that. Sav, uh, the science and medicine, you think? <laughs> Wait, really? Wait, taking this class? Like, taking the university class and get forbidden fruit this way? Kelly, thank you for the rave dance. We'll be doing plenty more rave dancing soon, actually. Stay tuned with that, because um, at 8 p.m. in game, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be throwing a rager, and you guys are going to see all of my light shows and stuff. It's gonna, there's going to be a lot going on. I hope you're all ready. I don't even know if I have enough juice keggers. I might have to just buy some more. In fact, screw this little bonfire. I think I should buy it when I'm ready. We're going to need more people doing the juice kegs. Should I throw one back here behind the bushes? Oh my gosh, could I? I mean, if it fits. That might be a padding nightmare. We're running out of space. Screw it, we'll surround us with... with a juice keg. That'll be fine. So I got two more. That should be hopefully enough. Because people keep getting freaking... They keep freaking out with like... You know, they can't get enough juice. Um, Blake, yeah, it just sucks. It's really unfortunate. The only thing I can recommend you do is go to, I think, Pleasant Sims. Um, I believe on her website she has a way to work with the Sim to get, like, Sims 2 running and all that garbage. Because, um, I unfortunately don't have a good resource. The only thing I can tell you is I, I'm pretty sure, because Pleasant Sims helped get mine running, and I think she might be able to help you with resources on obtaining it. I just know for me, um, I was given it from EA, so it's in my account. That's how I have my Sims 2. Yeah, Sav, that does sound fun. Yeah, see, Jose, I was going to upgrade my phone. I'm really tempted. I was, I, I actually, it sucks, guys, because I'm really trying to upgrade it soon because part of me is thinking this. There's supposed to be a really big astrological event happening soon. Um, biscuits, I'm doing good. How are you? Um, Abby, yeah, so I don't know if you saw what I was saying earlier or heard what I said earlier. Um, I saw your comment saying you have to tell me something, but I didn't see any comment after that. So I don't know if you heard the follow-up, but that part, I didn't I didn't see anything afterwards. I know that sometimes TikTok can, like, literally filter comments, and I won't know it, and you won't know it. So just a heads up, all I saw was you telling me you had to say something. I haven't seen anything, though. Um, yeah, so, Jose, there's this big event that's supposed to, like, light up the sky for, like, days, by the way. Yeah, it's supposed to, like, light the sky. People, apparently hundreds of years ago, people thought the world was literally ending, but it wasn't. It's not. Fear not. It is not. But, um... I mean, don't do me wrong. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a panicker. I do like to panic. It's just it literally in my blood. It's been a thing since I've been a kid. I remember doing it all the time. Anyways, I would like to have a phone that is actually like, a, you know, a better camera that can because this is something that's like, it's a priceless event that's about to happen. That's literally only gonna be experienced in our one lifetime, right? Just like the like, the eclipse thing that happened. You know how that swept swept the nation, like. You bet your ass I was an hour late to work. I'm staying home and I'm recording that thing. I'm not I'm not going to work on time. Screw that. Work is still going to be there, guys. That eclipse isn't happening again. 
Like, I mean, it will, but like to the degree that I was able to have it at, you know, for the angle that I was able to get. Yeah, no, I'm going to be late for work. <laughs> Sorry. You know, that's totally reasonable, I'm going to say. The 10th gen iPad? Um, I want to ask, though, is that, which one is that one, Jose? That's the one with, is that, does that have a home button or no? Because I know there's one more iPad on sale right now. And it's, it's one of those iPads, but it's, it's got a home. I'm just curious, which one is it? Drezm Storvula. Oh my gosh, Blake, yeah, literally the story of my life. No home button? Oh, okay, perfect. Then then this is the ninth generation. The ninth generation, Jose, is like dirt cheap. You're basically stealing it. Like right now, guys, you could go, I think, well, check Amazon, but I know Target is selling them for like $200, which is insane. But it's an old iPad. The 10th gen would probably be better if you're going to be spending the money, you know? So, also, hi, Dilf. But I would say it depends on what you're using it for, Jose. What you're look What you're looking to use it for. Let me go back and make sure I'm... Wait, what's it? Oh my gosh, Roblox, stop. Is Roblox crossplay? Like, if you're playing Roblox on your iPad, could I be playing with you on my computer, but you're on your iPad? I am at... Oh my fucking gosh, get out of here. Get out of here. Hey, Jill, I'm good. How are you? It's good to see you. Hi, Nala. I literally can't. Why can't we have more games like that? Like Minecraft. Like get your stuff together. I know there's Bedrock Edition, right? Which I guess would be the would be the version. I wish Java was better. I wish they could have made that work. I wish they could have made Java into the Bedrock. I wish they didn't have to fork it. Like I wish I wish we didn't have them separated like that. It's super annoying. One or the other. Like let's not have two different versions of Minecraft. It's super annoying actually. Wait, which ones have what's better than a Switch? Anything is? <gasps> oh no! I know. I can't wait, guys. Isn't Nintendo supposed to announce like their next, like the next Switch? Oh, it leaked and it's a mess. Oh no! Stop. Let me see this. Oh my gosh, our Lunchables are still up here. Our Lunchly. Uh, Switch. What are they calling it? Switch Two. There's no way. There's no way this is legit, though, right? It could be false, guys. It could be fake. It could be fakies. Have a good night, uh, Blake. It was nice meeting you. And thanks for hanging out with us. Hopefully, we'll see you tomorrow. I'll be on tomorrow um, around the same time, actually, about 15 minutes ago. So if you want to know when to expect me, because um, unfortunately, TikTok notifications aren't super like reliable. But uh, yeah, hopefully, we'll see you then. Honestly, my thing is... I mean, it looks, I mean, my first impression, it looks, it just looks like a Switch with, like, a bigger screen. If you ask me. Um, but who knows? Who knows, honestly? This could literally just be fake. And even if it's, if it's real, I mean, what's the issues, actually? What am I, I mean, am I missing something? Because when I'm looking at this, I should probably just be reacting to this, like, actually on stream. Here, hang on a second. Hold on. Window capture. Why can't I capture it? Is it because I minimized it? I actually can't. What the hell? What is going on, Tickfinity? It's not Tickfinity, it's Live Studio. What the hell is your problem? Do the thing. Why is it being dumb? I can capture Sims 3, which I already have, but I can capture it again. Brosif. <sighs> I'm too tired for this garbage, dude. I hate that. I hate when stuff just that is working fine decides to just be broken for a day. It's really annoying, actually. It's actually really extra annoying because there's no need for it. Like, it's unnecessary. Why is it broken? Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, why do I have to deal with this again? Let's see.
You know, I will say this, Jose. Um, one thing to point out there, especially because when, when we're talking specs, like I do hear your complaint with that. I do understand. I do. And I, I, I completely can relate to you. But at the same time, I realize that Nintendo isn't really a, like they're not all about making the latest and greatest or like in terms of like they're not trying to make the most powerful machines, right? They're not looking to have four like the 4K stuff or the most high res screens. You know, they're not that's just not their thing, right? Definitely not. Because like the DS, I loved my Nintendo DS. I think the DS is actually the last time they really made good quality, like solid built quality um, you know, stuff in my opinion um you know because we also have like our little our little 3ds xls here like this bad boy which i actually started thinking i think this is when some of the poorer quality started coming in like i'm gonna nitpick it like this like if you shake it it's hard to tell a little bit on screen maybe not but like the screen shakes now um i'm only pointing that little detail out because it just makes it feel cheaper and also the way the plastic feels whereas the um other DSs, the DS Lite, never did that. It never used to have like a screen shake, and it's it's just it's always been that way. So that's like a little detail nitpick, because I feel like their quality definitely hit, build quality. I feel like has gone down. Also, what I was trying to point out, what I'm really trying to point out here, is we have these little this joystick here, and um, this has been I've had this. Thank you guys for 10,000 likes, but I've had this for about since 2012 Christmas, and. Um, I have never, thankfully, had an issue with the Joy-Con drift. So I will say I do want to complain about that. I feel like it's interesting how they're making new consoles with Joy-Con drift so frequent. So in my opinion, if they can design a Joy-Con that clearly works just fine on a Nintendo DS, why couldn't they have just used that same design if it has less faults? If that has less faults, then why wouldn't they use a proven design that works better, right? Granted, it's more recessed in. I don't know if it's more preferred if people would be as comfortable using a joystick in that design factor. But all I can say is from that impression is this Joy-Con works, and I haven't had any issues with it, thankfully. Knock on wood. Um, but then the other Joy-Cons that you actually buy from the Switch you know, those ones are just notorious for having Joy-Con drift. And I find that to be interesting that they wouldn't try to redesign it or improve upon that. Um, those are my kind of gripes I would have with Nintendo. I'm not too worried about their screen qualities anymore, like in terms of it being a full HD display, because like I said, what I'm getting at, Jose, is I feel like I feel like Nintendo isn't the game station to... to you're not... I don't feel like... When you're going to buy a Nintendo Switch, I feel like you shouldn't be buying it to, to get a, a powerhouse, Right. Because I feel like they they don't really they're not the leading in like the best graphics. Like when I think of Nintendo, I think of family friendly, fun, lighthearted games like Mario and um, I guess Zelda is another one now because that one was really pushed with the Switch. And you know they had like Wii Sports, so a lot of their games weren't really graphically intensive. They were just lighthearted and fun, family friendly. So I guess I guess that's been always my impression of Nintendo. And when we also think of Pokemon, that stuff is also like very cartoony and it doesn't seem to really require a lot of like intense details. So that's, I guess, kind of my thinking. I'm, I'm thinking that I look at Nintendo as more of like a, the family-friendly guys. Like, they're, they're really good. I do enjoy their, their products, but I don't really take them as, you know, if I want like a, a big powerhouse, I'll build a tower. Or I guess a Steam Deck would be another option. But I don't think we should look at Nintendo's Switches as something that's supposed to be the best of the best. I think instead we should look at it for what it is and what they do sell. And I feel like they're, they definitely excel in family-friendly content. And that's kind of how I view it. Yeah, honestly, Jose, fair. That's, and that's totally fair. That is totally fair. Hi, McKenna. Oh, hell my gosh, guys. Are we ready for this rager? I told you guys we have some really cool lines. Yeah, I might need more effects, though. No problem. Yeah, guys. Hang on, let me fix this. Oh, these. Yeah, we got our party going. There's our rave. And now, I mean, people are still freaking out. Fred, thank you for the rave dances. <laughs> Do I do birthday? I know, right? Literally. Look, let's pretend we're a sim. Oh my gosh. Stop it with the galloping. 
the way the werewolves gallop away. I don't know where it went. Where's Dorito? Oh, he's, he's in the toilet. McKenna, thank you for the rave. Let's get ravey. Oh, something broke. What did you break? I didn't think the Ubisani toilet... Is it Ubisan? Ubisani? I don't know, but we'll solve that later. Dorito, we got a party. We got a bus to move. I need something to do a keg stand with me. Oh no, I gotta pour juice. I gotta refill it all. We're running out of juice. Any of them that are empty. We need juice. Are you serious? The party just started. I'm not even juiced up. The cops are already coming, you guys. This is dumb. Did I click on somebody? Ask everyone to leave. Dorito, Dorito, now's the time. Where is it? Now's the time, Dorito. It's the only time we hit. Streaking. We're gonna start it. Uh, Lils, I have a PC that I built. Well, if we, if the cops don't, if the cops come so soon, no one else is gonna be streaking yet. No one's all juiced up like Dorito. Um, yes, yeah, some of this content is from, uh, Showtime, yes. St <laughs> Jose, stop it! You can't say it like that. This is, um, I think this is from Showtime as well, but I had the, I bought the limited edition copy, so it came with, like, this little, this thing. DJ stand. It looks fun. You guys are all invited. No! Is it the same guy? It's Samuel. Samuel, stop it. I'm doing a cake stand, bro. You're gonna have to wait a minute. Hold on, I'm doing a keg. There you go, Carol. Samuel, you can't be serious. You can't be doing this to me. Samuel, you're really cock-blocking me. Oh, no. Come on, it was just getting good. Freaking Samuel. He crashed our party. That's how you know the party was good. I threw a raging party. That's what it was. I got another plus 45 mood lit. Well, guys, I guess it was successful. I don't think it was long enough, though. Freaking Samuel. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to become his friend, and then I'm going to invite him to the party. Then who's going to stop me, huh? Who's going to stop the party when the cop is the one attending the party, huh? You know, you guys weren't witnessing this, but last night and a few nights ago, when we were throwing other parties, Samuel was, uh, like, excited about it. Like, he was, like, cheering us on, but then he realized he's a cop, and he's got to, like, break it up. He had to do his job, you know? So, I feel like deep down, Samuel is a partier, plus he is a jock, not going to lie. So, I think there's potential there. Do it every Hi, Robin! We're going to do it again. We're going to have to do it again. I'm going to just text him until he until he doesn't hate me anymore, okay? Obsessively text until uh, he no longer hates me. Oh, he's no longer a cop. He turned out of his cop gear. It's like once you become friends with him, he'll no longer be a cop. Look at all the food people left on the floor. Oh, it's a plasma cobbler, deep fried onion fingers, and some white bread. Imagine just bringing a loaf of white bread to to a party. Now, if it's homemade, that's a different story. Oh, this might be a bit. We might have to really dig into Samuel. I forgot to order pizza. I also forgot to hug Carol. There was too much going on. I didn't have enough time to actually party. Um, Lil's yes. Yes, it came with its issues. Because Sims 3 is still Sims 3, so... Yeah, yeah. Sims 3 can be hard to run, but you just need to install some performance mods, and it'll definitely help your game, for sure. Sims 3 needs some extra help, though. 
I don't think it matters. I really don't think it matters what you spend on your computer. If you spend two thousand dollars on your computer, like it's still gonna run like ass. But that's just because it's Sims Three. Sims Three is just inherently bad because it's not. It's poorly optimized, and it also has plenty of bugs still. So many bugs that actually prevent you from playing the game a lot of the times. So, thankfully, we have an amazing, um, you know, community that loves the game too and still shares the. Uh, <laughs> They still share the passion for this game. So they're the ones bug fixing and, like, I guess modding out some of the issues in some cases. And it does certainly help. But, of course, you can't really replace... I mean, at the end of the day, realistically, we really just need EA to do their job. And they really just need to bug fix The Sims 3. Truly. Truly and dearly. Like, let's get them... We need to start a movement. They need to create a legacy team. One that offers support for all three titles. That's the, really the dream. From 1, 2, and 3. Just start reselling them on the EA app. You know people would pay for it. I absolutely would pay for it again. Granted, I was giving it for free, so why would I need to pay for it again? But hell, just to, su just to support the cause, buy The Sims 2 all over again. If it means that they're going to offer support and proper optimizations and being able to bug fix the games, why not? I think, um, I think paying for those things and giving them money if it's if it's you know if they're earning it you know if they're selling a product and pro and offering a service we pay for the service but when they're not offering those services the basic services as in you're they're selling a product that's broken you know there needs to be some kind of servicing but they don't really have any of that actually they don't have any of that they really don't they don't offer any kind of tech support really for this but they need to really improve that they need to be better with their uh they need to improve their customer relations, that's for sure. You know, relationships with their customers. Hopefully that's the right term, but you know. Oh, my motorcycle's electric again. You know what I've noticed? So when we load into the world, it turns electric. But then if I close the game and reopen it, or at least go to main menu and reload it, then I think the sound will play. So weird. Oh, my favorite, a rabbit hole job. All right, Dorito, we're going to have to really work hard this week. Nelly, also, welcome back, Nelly. Thank you for the finger heart and the heart poofs. Nelly, by the way, some good news. I mean, today was pretty slow progress. I'm actually I'm a little disappointed in the progress today for the pair pod. But yesterday, yesterday was some amazing progress, like incredible. Like we've, we've pretty much, we've done up a lot in the 3D CAD, okay? I think that's what it is. But we've done a lot of work. We have a lot ahead of us. But um, the PearPod news I have for you, I was, ho I was waiting to share it with you yesterday because I was so excited. So we actually did a lot of 3D work last night. I don't know if I have anything to show you. Let me see if I can. I don't think I can. No, I don't think I have anything to show you right now. But, anyways, we have we have a unibody created in this 3D software. We started we we bevel, they call I think he called it sh is it sh chimping? I think it's chimping or something like that. Like it's this. You know how the f edge of this iPhone has like the edges on it? It's like it's straight and then it's got edges chamfering i don't know what that's called but we have all that we have cute little details like that we have the shape we have literally the pear shape um we created a cutout for the back so this way the logo will light up um i actually just to this afternoon i just ordered the leds that are going to go into the back of this of the pear so this way the logo will actually light up and then he designed it to where the back plate will be a plate so we have all we have all that stuff ready where it's going to be like it's going to be double layered. It's going to be a plate of color and then it's going to have um, clear acrylic on top. So it'll have, so it'll, you know, you'll have the color and then you'll see the light shining through. So that's getting there. <laughs> um, I can't say the percentage. I actually would say that it almost feels like we, it feels like we did hard stuff, but I feel like there's more hard stuff to overcome. I feel like we have many more hurdles to come. So I visited my friend today and when I went there, the screw sizes are insanely tiny. Like they're 1.2 millimeters is how small they are they're in they're tiny 1.2 millimeters okay um that's like that's a little bit smaller than the thickness of a penny i believe which sounds kind of thick for a screw but anyways um so he needs to order a special screw set or whatever because he really then we're gonna do that and then once we do once that arrives 
we're then going to be able to get measurements of where the screw holes are to then apply that to the 3D model. So right now we're waiting on material that we have to order. And once we do that, we can then progress further. But the next steps are, are um, adding in screw holes to the 3D model along with... Um, then we have to design with the, yeah, the power button where the all the buttons are going to... We have to do the button cutouts, you know, the power button cutouts, all that stuff. Then we have to make sure the top part's going to be settled in, where the screen's going to set, and where the um, front plate is going to be. So we've got a little bit more work ahead of us, but we're getting there. Yesterday was a lot of work. I think I spent three hours on the phone with him. I think it was three hours. Yeah, I think I was on there. I was on with him for like three hours designing it with him. So it was going very well. So now I will reach out to him on Monday, because I think he said... I think, I'm pretty sure he said Monday or something. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to reach out. I'm going to text him Monday. And... um see where we're at or maybe i'll text him sunday and i'll be like hey i can hang out a little bit before work so i know i am too i'm really just tired today just a heads up but um also kaden hi how are you so good to see you um it's good progress though i think it kind of, now that i'm talking about it yeah it, it is it, it may not be as big but i guess you know baby steps we gotta get the right screws so we can work with it um, I obviously my suggestion to him is like, hey, if the screw thing, if the screw situation doesn't work, let's just like I, I suggest let's just tape down the circuit board to this, you know, to the whatever. He doesn't want to do it that way, which is fine. He wants to do it like legit, so um, which is fine. I, I totally get that. I'm fine to make. Oh my gosh, these streakers are everywhere. Oh, it's Carol. Actually, I need a friendly hug. You could you put your clothes back on so we can hug? Oh no, he's got to go to class. Never mind. He has a wish to hug Carol. Go streaking. You know what? Screw the hug. I'm going to streak before class. Ooh. Dorito wants to streak? I refuse to believe that this is like a normal part of university. <laughs> Stop it. The little laugh. I can't. Yeah, I think so too, Nelly. He definitely is. He's definitely interested in it. And um, it sounds like he'll be interested in the next step too. The next, the next step after this, because this is just basically adding and this is creating a case for the iPod essentially. So the next step really is going to then be creating our our kind of own. Which it's going to be using Raspberry Pi. Not Raspberry... Well, it might be Raspberry Pi based. I guess we'll see. But we're going to... I don't know if you're familiar with any of that stuff. I'm going to go to that. Go to class. I'm pretty sure it's this building. But what do I click on? Attend in intermediate slacking off 102. I'll do that after. Actually, no, I won't. Because I think there's three classes today. Yeah, so we'll see. Yeah, okay, well, hang on, Ichiro. I appreciate it. I do appreciate it. But commercializing it, there's a huge gray area still. I'm still I'm still not sure where I'm going to go with that yet. Once I make these little proof of concepts and we work this out with him, this is the hardest part. Because once these are actually designed, I, and I already think we, I, I might want to modify some things, but like once these are actually created and we have some like real-life prototypes, you know, I'm going to go from there. And then I'm going to start creating like potentially a business plan. And then it's really going to probably be raising money because... um. When I do it, I want to do it right. So I'm going to want to create the actual screen. I would want to actually make a pair screen. But in order to do that, we need to reach out to like people like manufacturers, screen manufacturers. I was talking about this last night. So the way the next step I'm thinking I'm going to have to go is first off, I'm also going to need to have pr I, before I even get to that point, I would have to make sure that Nickelodeon doesn't mind. That's a big that's a big thing. That's the big thing that might be stopping this entire project, by the way. So you have to see if Nickelodeon minds, which I don't know how much they will mind, because realistically, there's already TikTok videos of people playing with these and using them. Um, and there's actually ones that are better quality than the one I'm having here. Um, and they make videos on it. And there's there's people that are selling these on Etsy. So I almost feel like if Nickelodeon or Paramount, Paramount cared a lot, they probably would have already taken down those sites. Or maybe they just haven't discovered those, um, those places selling them. Um, anyways... So once we figure that out, if they don't mind and it's not a, a protected, like, you know, I'm not infringing on them, then I will go forward and trying to, like, create an actual product, create a business plan, then probably create, like, a, um, uh, maybe it's a, what is it, not GoFundMe, it'd probably be, like, a uh, Kickstarter or some shit like that, whatever those websites are, and um, we'd be promoting the product, 
And then I would basically raise the money so I could order, custom order, pear-shaped screens from an actual manufacturer to create them, ship them to me. We would probably, I guess my friends and I would be assembling. We'd probably just be assembling it. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what, I have no idea what I'd be doing. So it's baby steps though. So baby steps. We'll see how things go. Yeah. I guess we'll see, Sav. I guess we'll see. Oh my gosh. That's awful, Millie. How long do sunburns last? How come you have to remove them, Chloe? Sims 3 is my favorite one as well. Liz, yes, I am. I am. I really got to get myself in the loop. I keep being out of the loop with stuff. Two weeks. Yikes. Oh my gosh, that sucks. Taylor, thank you for the heart me. Oh. How much storage do you have on your computer, Chloe? Let me pick your brain. I feel like Sims 4 needs to be uninstalled. That's what I'm thinking. I think that's the problem. Well, there is your problem. You got bloatware on your computer. Do I have to mess with this thing? What's that, Jiro? I'm good, though, Taylor. How are you doing? Oh. Yeah, three terabytes is good. I have one terabyte. And it's it can be stressful at times, actually. Space is kind of a constant battle. Mhm. Mm one hundred percent, Kaylee. I'm. Yeah, I agree with you. Ooh, when's your birthday, Taylor? Hmm. That's fair, Chloe. Well, you could also look into maybe uninstalling some games if, if that's what it is that's taking up a lot of your space. Like, there could be some... You could look into, like, uninstalling and reinstalling as needed. I know that's super annoying. If you have good internet, it's not so bad, I guess. But, like, for example, I like to play Apex Legends or Fortnite, right? But I uninstall them. Because right now, like, I'm not playing Fortnite. Right now, I'm not playing Apex, which, to be honest with you, I don't know. I don't know if I'll get back into Fortnite for a while. I tried getting back into it, and I just was, like, dog doo-doo at the game. I'd have to really get... I'd have to really get back into it, but, eh. I'm not too invested in that game right now. Oh, it's coming up, Taylor. You're one week away. It goes so fast. Dead space. City skylines, yeah. I wouldn't worry too much about pictures. I mean, it depends on how many pictures you're taking. I mean, if, you, if you're if you someone who takes a lot of screenshots like I do, like in Minecraft and just in any games, like when I do this, then yeah, I would say screenshots or pictures can be a thing. It depends on how many how many pictures you like to store on your computer. I feel like if, unless you do videos, like videos is definitely a one that's going to be, that's a big one, usually. They definitely take up space, though, Nelly, for sure. All right, guys, 13 hours, and then we have another class. Oh, my gosh, some sushers. What am I going to eat tomorrow? Oh, I have leftover Chipotle. I miss my sushi. I miss eating sushi, and I miss my mac and cheese. I've been talking about it. Everything's broken in my house. Everything's borking. Good luck, Dorito. What am I? Level 6 handiness? He should be fine. Just jam your screwdriver in that hole. And then twist it a little bit there. Poke that spot. See how that goes. And then the smoke should go away. Look at that. Genius. Absolute genius. 
Dorito is just too good. Go out on a date? Screw it, let's do it. <laughs> 100% <laughs> Chloe. Thank you, Bella. It doesn't it make the game contagious. It's a very attractive game, especially when it's smooth. It's such a beautiful game. I tr I really freaking love it. What are you doing here? Wait, why is he here? Whose party are you wrecking now? Aww, a protest? <laughs> wow, Samuel is really ruining all the fun for everybody. <laughs> Sorry, I hung up on something. Maybe we can meet up again soon. You mother effer, dude. I was about to, like... I was about to plunge my toilet. I would rather be plunging my toilet right now. I hear the geese! Where the hell are they? I heard them. I heard them. Mm, they're just invisible. I'll plunge my toilet tomorrow. Actually, I'll do it now. I can't believe this toilet broke. I thought it was unbreakable. I know it says I could upgrade it, but I remember it being advertised as something that's unbreakable. School chickens. Jeez. Calling geese school chickens. Oh, good luck. Who is it this time? Darren. And they're a rebel. I just, I wish you luck. That's all. Doritos got this one, you guys. Do I not have an alarm? Oh, I'm going outside to the porch. They haven't even broken in yet. They haven't even broken in yet. Dorito knew his intentions. <laughs> he doesn't even he doesn't even let him break in. Yeah, get out of here. Yeah, Dorito, Dorito doesn't mess around. That makes you extremely filthy. I just showered, too. Did he bike away? Which way did he go? That way. I'm probably, he's probably just going to go and despawn. Kind of ironic there with the cop, huh? Is he breaking up another party? Hang on a second. He's despawning. He's gone. Is there a party going on? Is that what's going on over here? This is a nice house. I actually really like this. I don't like how this isn't on a foundation, though. This would have looked so much better on a smaller foundation and then doing this. But this is beautiful. I like this. That's pretty. I actually I like these house designs. They're very cute. Yeah. I mean, a little iffy on the basement being right there, I guess. It's kind of strange. Not used to that kind of design. Um, but yeah, this is nice. A ping pong room? That's really nice. I'm all for that. Whoopsies. Okay, so we got a bedroom. Hmm. Yeah, nothing up here. That's cool. I like it. It's a cute house. They're all like attached garage, though. Do any of them have an attached garage? They're all detached, is what I meant to say. I don't know if I said that. Literally, every house has, like, a detached garage. That's mildly annoying. I'll do. Weird. It's okay, though. This house looks fancy. What the heck? What the heck? Why is there so much food? And it's all expired. Ooh, what is that? Deep fried maple bacon ice cream? Okay, not gonna lie, that sounds pretty good. I mean, I'm kind of iffy on maple bacon stuff, you know? Like maple bacon donuts. I don't know if you guys have ever had that, but there's like a donut shop in my area that does like cake donuts and they have like a maple bacon 
one. And I don't know how I feel about that sometimes. But in this case, we're talking deep fried maple bacon ice cream. I think that sounds like it would go really hard. That sounds good. Oh, some cinnamon rolls. <gasps> Dinner rolls. Those are kind of basic. Oh my gosh, not the pizza. <gasps> Spoiled deep fried candy bars. Oh my gosh, what will they come up with next? Man. Spoiled apple cup. Look at all this food. What happened? Think of all the parties they had. This must have been a party, dude. How does this happen? That's crazy. That's wild. Okay, well. Filthy, filthy, filth. Freaking animals, you guys. Okay, that's fake. That's, that's crazy. I've never seen anything like that. Do I hear more, I hear more geese? I keep thinking I'm hearing the geese. I'm after those birds. Yeah, I feel like that, honestly, Kaylee, and I feel like that would work. I think it's the deep frying part that really saves it. Deep fried ice cream, I think, really can work. Alright, time to go to collage. I'm gonna go make a collage today. My, look at my e-bike. Oh, sweet. We get to use the building I, I renovated. Guys, check it out. So I renovated the school a little bit. I added lockers, naturally, so it makes it look more school. I can check out the classroom. You guys ready for this? It's like an actual classroom now. I'm very proud of it. I think I, I think it turned out really well. Maybe the chair should be metal. Wait a minute. You hear the squeaks? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Crap, wrong button. When my first little Sims video like went like took off, people went digging on Twitter and at the time Twitter. They were talking about how objects like chairs are also recognized. So like if I were to switch this, for example, to metal, theoretically, it should make metal noises. Let me see. Game. Oh my gosh, please load all these textures. So if I were to switch it to like this. Yeah. I'll just do this. Now I'm curious. So Dorito, what if you got up really quickly? Oh. Does it sound like wood still? Let me see. It doesn't. Wait, let me see, let me see, let me see. Okay, squeak. Wait. Mm, hang on, actually, I think it does still sound like wood. Wait. Well, actually. I need you to pay attention, Dorito. How about, like, write your notes? I need him to use the desk. Okay, I think it did change the noises. I feel like it did. Yeah, I'm just making sure that sound doesn't play. I think that sound also played on the wood one. So I'm just, I was just trying to make sure of that. I was just checking that. Everyone's sleeping in class. Yeah, for sure. I think so, Red. Now, sound design in this game, pretty next level. Druido, the only one in a metal chair. Thank you guys for 20,000 likes, everyone. Oh, 
Well, Dorito does want to streak again. Actually, before you do that... Just gonna block the door. Dorito. Fred, thank you for the gifties. Hi, Angie. Is that what he wanted to do? Yes. Now he wants to streak. Alright, Dorito. Live your best life. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's the little hee hees he does. I love it. It's just cute. <laughs> this freaking game. Steal Von de Garn. I don't get it. The streaking and then just dancing. How long does this action last? No problem, Red. Oh my gosh, I'm streaking to another class. That was wild. All right, let's try to disturb this class. We're gonna distract. We're gonna distract this whole entire class. Hang on. Now we need to do. What's this? Oh. Let's do that. Akaduni. No, where's the jock stuff? You're a fake mascot. I got a picture with the llama. Oh my gosh, you're a fake. I can't practice the dance with you? Oh, I got congratulated. That's cute. But look at there's no there's no option. I'm a jock, but I can't practice it with her. What a fake. Mas mascot training? Let me do that. Barble. Baba? Look at the stink guy. He looks like a professor. Oh, she didn't like that. We need to be more friends with her. Oh, it's Alfred. I don't think he was waving at me, though. Can I attend this lecture? Whoops. Hmm. Now we're friends. Mascot training. I love it, Shelby. Sims 3 is my favorite one. Seriously? But we're friends. Oh, not anymore. Ridiculous. I want to become a llama too. Who is this? 
I swear the texting thing gets so annoying. It's her. I want to become Llama. It's like it's like over the top. Welcome back, Red. That's funny, Dizzy. So many cops. There's so many like a lot of people find with double names in here. It gets confusing sometimes. Another class? I like how it has multiple classes. That's pretty cool. How'd that go, Red? I think she is a nerd, right? No. I'm disappointed that I can't practice the cheer with the actual mascot. Hi, Tang. It's okay. Welcome back. Glitzergam. She's a nice one. Torque. The outfit's ridiculous. Okay, we don't need to do that. I guess I'll have to go. I missed it. I missed their practice. The Vogue Gerbits was so cool. It sounded so cool. Wait, were you? Wait, 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 would you restart it? Wait, what happened now, Red? Oh, so you said you were restarting it? Is that what you were saying? Okay, that's so weird, though. So did the other one refund? Okay. That's cool. At least you got. It's nice that it was that fast, actually. Well, thank you for the promotion. I'm so tired. I just feel it in my eyes. I don't think I got the best rest last night. No, it's okay. I don't blame you. It would annoy me too. For it to instantly end like that, that's really irking. So I understand. Oh, Rex's party? Uh. Uh, it's not like my rager parties, you know? I don't know if there's any particular reason. I just didn't. Mm. So, I'm tired. I'd rather clean my toilet than give a charming introduction to somebody. There we go. I bet you have a lot of food in here. Oh, I don't. Memorize scene? What? Oh, it's that. Never mind. Wait, where's my selfie with the llama? I got this one. I don't see it. I don't see the other selfie. Well, Dorito, wait, we can't go to bed. Yeah. Actually, we can. We can go to bed. You're right. Holy 100,000 lifetime happiness points. And what do I spend it on? Yes, thank you, Red. I hope so, too. Let me see. What could I get? Wow.
food replicator. Motive mobile. That one's kind of interesting. The flying vacuum? Okay, I think I know what you're talking about. There it is, right? It's a bird, it's a broom, no, it's a flying vacuum. Step up and ride in the luxury and style that only a vacuum can provide. I have messed with that. That is goofy. I wish they added more of these. You would need so much points to be able to get a lot of these. Inheritance? I wonder how much you'd get for that. Hmm. We'll come back. Hi, Holly. We'll come back. Oh, I bet, Red. I bet it is. All the memes online when you take a nap and you wake up, it's like, what year is it? <laughs> Dorito's always getting sick. All right, I'm gonna. First thing I gotta do is order pizza. It's weird to say that, guys, because. One of, so, guys, when I played Club Penguin with my sister, way back when, you weren't allowed to say the words call me. It would literally block them out. Like, you couldn't use the word call me in that game. Which makes sense. All, all fairness now, as now that I'm an adult, I see why. It's for safety reasons. But as a kid, so you want to know what our, our words were? So we, knew, so we knew when to call each other. We used to say order pizza. We would just be like, order pizza. And that's how we knew to talk on the phone. Yes, Diana, give me my pizza, please. Look how massive that pie is. Yes. Beautiful. Why did it sound like that when I set it down? Well, I might as well get comfortable with uh, the fishing idea. Why does it do that? That is a little bridged. Anyways, let's go here. Whatever's closest to the ocean, I guess. We gotta work on our attendance here, or our performance, because holy crap, we are flunking so hard. Oh my gosh, Kaylee. How'd you sleep, though? Dang, the bike was such a good investment. There we go. He's a singer. I don't know why the sound is off a little bit, but yeah, he's <laughs> it's a little off. He is cute, though, isn't he? Oh, 
He does sing well, doesn't he? You hear it from your right now. Now your left. I heard the sound. No. So, Dorito has um, a hidden trait called, uh, what's it called again? French culture. And some hidden traits can actually give you different, like, things. So in this case, French culture, he just, he knows the French songs, and he just sings them. And then, like, another thing about French culture is, like, if he greets a sim, normally for the first time, he'll do, like, a kiss. Like a French, French, I guess, like, the French greeting kiss stuff, I guess. I don't know. I don't want to say French kiss, because I feel like that means something else, too. I don't really know. But he does a thing where you kind of like kiss from the side to the side, you know, when you're, yeah. But French. So he was born with it. So he actually is a um, part of my generational playthrough, my legacy playthrough from a long time ago, way before. Like I don't, I've not, I haven't done a legacy playthrough in so long. So, anyways, um, he dates back a while. But there was like I think the fourth, third or fourth generation married into a French guy, and so the trait was passed down. Uh, from a couple gen from either a generation or two ago from him and uh that's how he got it that's how dorito became dorito yeah that's what i thought i thought french kiss i figured it did i knew it meant something different but then i was thinking like what do i call that then a french greet i guess crap we have class in two hours Oh, and it's a Wednesday. Guys, I might fail. I shouldn't say fail, but dude, getting onto the Dean's list might be hard. It's Wednesday. I kind of was farting around a little bit. I need to really work on these skills. Gardening. Science skill. What even is a science skill? Oh, it's the new skill. I know what to do. Yeah, an air kiss. I guess that's what it'd be. Yeah, like um, to, like yeah, they they're um, uh, what is it called? I know what you're talking about. But then there's another one where it says can apprehend a burglar, and Dorito has that one too. That's why when that burglar came in, like you saw him like spring right into action because he has the hidden trait of can apprehend a burglar. Wow, Okay, as soon as we're done with class, guys, we need to work on our science skill, I think. Actually, maybe I could take some... That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take some classes while taking classes. So I'm taking a class, and I'm going to take another class. Because I need some classes with my classes. <laughs> Thank you, Red, for the gifties. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take science classes, gardening class, and I'm going to try taking a fishing class. We need to catch up. Because we are behind. Once we catch up, guys, we can throw some absolute ragers. Don't you worry, okay? We have more parties in the pipeline. <clears throat> it's coming. So many good little moodlets. Hey, Orion. How are you? Which building is this one? Okay. Jeez, this is only our second class. Dorito's so hungry. Can I roast marshmallows? Dang. That's crazy that you can't roast a marshmallow on a bonfire. I feel like that would make sense, right? Maybe. Hmm. 
Ah, oh, Sam is running another party. Those are usually garbage. Don't need to do that. Oh, Sabata! Hang on, Dorito, one more class. Oh, Rex. Oh, that one? That is the germy. It's because Dorito's feeling sick. I think if you get your flu shot, it goes away. You too, Orion. Have a good evening. Thanks for popping in. Hi, Corinna. Welcome back. Yeah. I'm pretty sure that mood lit actually comes with seasons. <laughs> Neat. Huh. Her hair and being a vampire, she looks cool. I'm good, Corinna. How are you? I'm just super freaking tired tonight. Johnny, we are doing Sims 3. University. What are you doing? <laughs> Perf. Okay. Um, let me quickly get him some food. Oh, but he's tired. We can do this, though. Alright, we'll do a quick recharge at home. I think we'll be alright. I think we can catch up. We can do this. I have Thursday, basically. Yeah, I'm pretty freaking tired myself, Corinna. I feel you. Doritos, let's... Oh, yeah, that's right, we got pizza. I love pizza. Whoops, didn't mean to turn that on. Pizza's so good. I'm going to have to get pizza again. It's funny, I got a wish to clean the dishes, but there's no dishes with pizza. Why does this... Ugh. Oh, she just keeps breaking. Now I have to nap, and then I have to fix it. Really quick, Doritos. We can do this. It's going well, Johnny. My my plan is to do um all the all the majors. What's your favorite feature of the university pack? I know, Corinne. I won't. I won't. I'll be. I'll get off soon, actually. Just so I can catch up. Okay, now we gotta fix this. Mm. Now that we're well, we have a nice nap. It kind of overrides the super tiredness. Perf. Nope. It's sleepy's time. I am so tired. There we go. Okay. As soon as he gets up, we're taking... Oh my gosh, I can't take any classes. No, there's no night classes. But I can apply for extra funds. I can also pose nude for money. It's As I always say, it's fine because it's for art. All right, there we go. I'm going to go get some money. College literally pays you to go here. You actually get paid to go here. 
$2,800. It's free money right there. We can probably start taking classes at 6 a.m. Oh, we have a class at 3. I guess I'll mess with the anatomy thing. Bone up on anatomy. Well, okay, it's class time. I think we're actually going to be doing that for our class today. We're going to be doing the anatomy stuff. Yep, that's what we're doing. Florbem, Rebzu, Grefum, Shreb. Tripnor, Frutza, Blevni, Freem. Freem. Nobnu, Arobite, Trelvum, Garabim. Garabim. Ectorabim, Karabja, Drebno, Farib. Farib. Twainush, Manusel, Freebza. Manusel, Manusel. Yavav. Tripnor, Frutza, Tripnor, Freem. Large! To Harbino, Semzor, Reboof, Semzor. Hmm. Catching some of it. Venus Arevum Trelv. Oh, that's a hard one. Nobnu Arobite Trelvum Garabim. Hmm. Argno Tugafaji. Do you play Sims, Thomas? Florbum Rebzu Grefum Shreb. To Harbino Samzor. Do we just keep studying the skeleton? Is that the class? I think it is. When is it until? It's my Thursday class till 10 a.m. That can't be right. We've already been here for like an hour. Why is this, was I that early? I was an hour early. What skill is this even for? <gasps> Complete four degrees? Yes. Oh, so it's a science skill. I was curious about that earlier. Okay. Actually, I don't really need to go to the map, but I'm going to do it anyway. Science class. Gardening class. And then we also need to take a class in fishing, if I can. Which I don't know if there is. No... I don't think there's any fishing classes. Donate saliva? What the heck? Okay, we're gonna do this. What is your name? Wicked Witch of the Weast. I love it. Welcome to the stream. I know Sims is my favorite one. Hi, Jelly. I'm, I, my day was good. How was yours? Thomas, this is Sims 3. Jelly, thank you for the rose. Also, Sin, thank you for the rose as well. From earlier, if you're still there. This should give us a nice little uh, boost here. The yellow or the green bar that we have once we take these classes. Hoping to throw money at the problem. Okay, it barely helped. How about a little bit of gardening action? Okay, this one's going to be hard. Why is having all these degrees just getting harder? Oh my gosh, that didn't do anything. It didn't do anything, but it told me gardening helps. All right, screw off, game. I'm going to go fishing. Dorito likes fishing, so back to fishing. That is ridiculous. I spent $400 on that. Good, Jelly, good. Glad you're doing better. Okay, Dorito, I told you to go fishing. Why aren't you fishing? Oh, he is hungry. I can't with this game sometimes. And I guess I'll just go straight down this way for the water. I just am looking for some fishies. So, Red, thank you for the bracelet. Yeah, it, there's so much to do, Johnny. I have plenty of videos on my page detailing, well, detailing details, actually. Talking about all the little details of the game. I just gotta eat some yummies really quickly. Aw, oh, cool. These parking lots, like, this actually blends really well. 
There's my motorcycle. It's like an actual interior and everything. It's almost like, why didn't they make this into an actual building? The square glass. I don't know how I feel about square glass like that. I don't really care for it, to be honest with you. Magician. So pretty. Oh, everything loads in. Well then. Butterfly Spirit, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the community. Uh, yeah. At some point, I will I will definitely do more Diner Dash. At some point. Because that I did, I did just binge the entire series, basically. You know? It was intense. A lot. We did a lot of Diner Dash. I definitely overdid it for sure. All right. Um, I'm feeling less confident in how we can catch up. My little secret weapon was taking classes, and so far that didn't really do anything. I guess I could study. I thought being an angler would help here. It kind of is. We needed more time. We might... I think we can still make it work. He's getting a wish to study. So I'm going to get home and I'm going to do that. Okay, actually guys, I think we're going to be in the clear. I think we'll be in the clear. He's getting tired. The next of it, I'm just going to study. Game house games? I want to say I have. I feel like I have. Ooh, yeah, okay, a lot of people were talking about the Delicious series. I do remember that. When we were playing Diner Dash, a lot of people were bringing that one up. All right, readers, let's recharge. Once we sleep, I'm going to do a lot of studying, and then we should be okay. Oh, but it's a long day, too. We can do this. Ideally well-rested. Come on, game. Good thing we have the best bet in the game, huh? It's actually kind of broken. It's store content. So it's kind of a bed. It's not really a bed, but it's also a bed. Cheat exam? Nah, we're not going to cheat. We're going to do it the real way. We're going to study. Can you study hard? You sure can. Pizza. We need pizza for dinner. This is so this is so college. Back to studying. With our greasy ass hands. That's what we're gonna do. Aw oh, Johnny, thank you for the follow. Officially welcome to the community. Oh, good to know, Red. Okay. Got it. Well, Holly, am I glad you asked? Not really, but yes, kind of. Um, there wasn't a whole lot of progress. I was a little disappointed in the progress tonight. Um, that's okay. That's okay. Because um, there's still a step in the right direction. Um, I also lost a screw to the device, but which is not a big deal. We're going to order new screws. So basically, here's what happened. I went to my friend's house, and because um, I was hoping to do more modeling today, but unfortunately, we're not. We we he my friend wanted to wait because he wants to order some screws. This way, we can ensure that we have the right screw sizes that'll go into. The, into the board so the next step is we're trying to map out the screw holes so 
in this little iPod, right? In the, the metal body itself, there's like a screw hole here and here and here for the motherboard to fit to, to actually like, you know, put it to the board, attach it. So um, I lost the screw just actually on my way home. But anyways, aside from that, he w so in order to see and see it and to get it, we're trying to make sure where we have to design it. So in this case, we need to find out where those points go. So in, in the meantime, he's saying that he doesn't have a screw small enough for it, or I think even the bit to do it. So I think that's what we're waiting on. We're waiting on parts, and so he's got to order these parts. And once those come in, which I'm assuming sometime next week, um, then we'll be able to continue going further with the actual 3D model. Um, on top of that, I did order the, the LED that's going to be attached to the back for making it so it's going to glow. So there is baby step. It was definitely baby steps because today before work, I ordered the, the parts for the lights. And so then hopefully he can order those parts tomorrow, I guess, by tomorrow, hopefully, um, to do the screw pieces. And so then next week, those things should come in and we'll see. I do expect more hurdles. I'm expecting to be more like hurdles on the computer, though, because once we have the screw sizes designed and once we start having everything in there, like I'm wondering about the supports because like, Maybe we'll have, we'll figure it out. I think everything will it'll it'll all work out. Maybe it won't be as hard as I'm thinking, but I don't know. We'll see. I'm curious how it all is going to actually fit together. But yeah, I'm really curious actually. We'll see. We'll see. It is definitely baby steps. But we're getting there. Hi Mars. I love pizza too. But yeah, that's pretty much the update. It was definitely um definitely some baby steps, but we are definitely going in the right direction, right? At the end of the day. At the end of the day, we're in the right direction. My friend is, like, really invested in the idea of, like, making our own screens. He legitimately is trying to look into, like, how to make our own LCD screens. Which I've chat GPT'd it. And it doesn't seem like it's really going to be a feasible option. But that's how much of a techie guy he's into. Like, he's really into this stuff. As far as, like, being so curious as to making, like, making our own LCD. I think that's just too far. I think, realistically speaking... If I ever get to the point where if I if I if I want like if it comes down to the point where I have the desire to take it this far and if I'm it, you know I'm gonna, if I try to we'll see how it goes, we'll see how everything goes and how I feel about it and if I have the passion and interest for it I'm just following I'm following the passion, if the passion sticks with me, and I really am serious and I want to keep going with it then I'll take the steps needed and we'll try to make this into a real product that you guys could potentially buy which I think would be awesome. I think it'd be really exciting. So I would love to, to be able to do something like that. It sounds cool, but it depends, you know? I mean, see how things go. Play it out. See how things feel. Go from there. Yeah, he is. He is. It's good. Because obviously I'm pay I am paying him, right? But um, it's obviously it's really nice that he has invested in it as well. So, yeah, he's, he's, a, he's a good egg. I'm going to have to push you a little bit, Dorito, okay? buy some music again yeah that's the only downside because even with my marketing idea with the with this um dr dran wait bro oh it's bra jeez i really struggled there uh, thank you for the follow welcome to the community um the thing is though nobody likes to buy music right even back when music buying was the main option it's like people would just download it right more more often than not so it's like it's kind of hard to say like what the answer is going to be Maybe we could sell music packages instead of, like, a monthly payment. I don't know. I don't know. I'm trying to think of a new way. Because otherwise, I mean, music, maybe people, maybe people would buy music again. I don't freaking know. But anyways, it's going to be, yeah, it's obviously, it's, it's going to just be a fancy MP3 player that's going to be focused on the user experience. The idea is to create an immersive user experience that's disconnected from the internet. That's pretty much the plan. And there will be some like social actions on it, in the sense that if you if you are if you meet somebody else with a with a pear pod if if that's what it becomes named, we'll see how things go. Um, I have I have ideas. I have I have some really good ideas that I think will have. I think it's a it could be a very fun product. So uh, obviously, unfortunately, I, I have no idea what the price would even be. Like I have no idea how that's all gonna go. Like it's so, and obviously that's a that's a big thing that dictates value, of course, too, right? But We'll see. We'll see what happens. I have, I have no idea. It's hard. I don't have the infrastructure like that these big companies have, too. So that's another thing that can indi that can dictate prices, right? Like, oftentimes, like, think about, like, you know, think about, like, Teslas and stuff. Think about, like, how the first cars were and how expensive they were and how unobtainable it was for an average person to have. But now, like, I wouldn't even say average, but a lot of people can afford, like, a, a Model 3. Those are pretty cheap now in, in comparison to what they originally started with. iPhones. 
they started off extremely expensive, and now they're pretty cheap, I would say. There's so many options that you can get them relatively, you can get them pretty damn cheap now. So, I don't know. And basically, though, I'm not sure what the price is going to be, but it it's, I, I can't imagine it's going to be uh, as cheap as I would like it to be. But we'll see, you know? I feel like the hardest part is getting the designs, and then, yeah, going from there. Oh, I know, yeah, our old computers. <laughs> Honestly, fair. Oh, wow, we made it work. We're passing with the expense of Doritos' mental health. All right, I'm fixing it. I'm fixing it, Dorito. It's okay. We did it. We're about to be on the Dean's list. We recovered. Maybe it only matters to be on the Dean's list on actual finals of next week. It just gets confusing because this, fr this Friday is also lit up in red. So it confuses me, making me think that I have to perform. Like, I feel like I have to perform really well on this week and next week, right? But may maybe it's not the case. But that's certainly how I'm treating the game, because that's how I definitely feel. I gotta get, I gotta get to the other building. Yeah, so we'll see. Obviously, I'll, I'll share more on these ideas and all this stuff uh, the further we get. You know? Baby steps. Baby steps. I guess I should start putting together the video for this that I'm wanting to make here. Instead of waiting until everything to get done, I should just start putting together what I do have. Because I realized as the time goes by, I'm getting stuff. And honestly, guys, today, we fought off like a murder hornet today when I was there. Like, we, when I was there at his house, we were looking at the iPod and stuff. And he was like, oh, let's see what I have in the shed for like, you know, for screw sizes and we went out to the shed just for one little screw just to see and this freaking like it looked like a murder hornet or like some big like queen like wasp or something was in there and it was terrifying so we had to fight that thing off for like 20 minutes so i filmed it a little bit he did finally get it though he did end up getting it it was kind of scary but that was pretty memorable um after this we have two more degrees And then it looks like he doesn't gain an additional trait for each degree. Instead, it changes out the degree. So the red icon is because I earned it from his, you know, university academic experiences, it says. So every time you get a new degree, you get to change it out again. So I just click the random button each time. Yeah, I think, I feel like it had to have been a wasp. It wasn't like a nice, well, because they're like more pointy and angry looking, right? Bees are more cute. I'm pretty sure. Well, either way. We did it. Dean's List and Passing with Flying Colors. The Dean's List. I wonder why they call it that. What did I just do? Did I meet somebody for the first time? Oh, Eddie. Him passing out. I don't even know what's going on. <gasps> Mother of Chihuahuas. Oh my gosh, I love that name. I had a Chihuahua. Is there any karaoke places around here, actually? I don't know if there are. There's a bowling alley. I didn't know there was farming. There's no karaoke, is there? No. Baba Rooney. I feel like this could look better if it was like pink or magenta. There he is. Look at that little face. Such an iconic dog, dude. He's such a beautiful doggy. It's so weird seeing dogs so animated, though. Not used to it. Like at my friend's house while we're doing the pear stuff and his freaking animals, dude. Oh, they're Shih Tzus. Oh, where are you going? Is Samuel going to break up another party? Huh. Oh, so like a little performing spot. That's cute. Mm. 
I'm actually curious where that keg is that he's going to refill. Uh, anyways. Oh, that's sad, Red. Is it Jada or Mickey? Hope they feel better. Wait, what are you trying doing in here? Like, what do you mean? Like, the style of the buildings? Oh, hopefully she feels better soon, Red. Alright. Tomorrow, we'll come back. We'll throw a party. We'll throw some more ragers tomorrow, you guys, okay? Stay tuned for some more partying. And we're gonna finish this degree tomorrow. We can do this. I am going to bed. Dorito's going to bed, and I'm going to bed, IRL. Oh no, he's only going to wake up at 2 a.m. I should let him play some video games. Oh, the row buildings. Yeah, it's actually interesting because the way they achieved those, the row housing, it actually, there's some, there's some interesting tricks they did. So, it makes sense that they were able to do it the way they did. It's crazy how fast this thing is. Kazane. Oh. Um. Actually, I want to fill this. I want to fill this fun bar really quickly. Gosh, look how smooth the game runs. There. I just wanted to do that. Randall, thank you for the GG. Appreciate that. Appreciate the little gifty. Okay, I am super tired IRL. Um, I need to go to bed. I have work tomorrow too. Yeah. You too, Randall. Thanks for hanging out with us. We're going to be doing part eight. I think it's part seven tonight. I'm pretty sure. Um, but tomorrow will be part eight, and we should be hopefully completing our science and medicine degree tomorrow and starting the next one. Thank you, Red. Or thank you, Ichiro. <laughs> oh, of course, of course, Ichiro. Yeah, yeah. I know I was really tired. I actually didn't even think to get to not be on tonight. Sometimes when I'm really tired, I do. Well, I started noticing it too because, like, when I was at work today, it's like you can feel it in your eyes. I don't know how else to describe it. But you guys obviously know what I'm talking about. Like when you're tired in your eyes, and it's not necessarily when your eyes feel heavy, but like you can feel it. You know, it just feels tired. And then, um. I noticed that like my legs started feeling weird. I'm like, what's going on? Am I dying? What's happening? I think it's just maybe my muscles are tired, right? Is that what it is? I feel like that's what it is. Why did my why did it disconnect? Oh no, we're here. But like I think that's what that is, right? I guess your muscles can be tired if you're tired, right? Like you can feel tired from them. It's almost like a, a light fatigue. Like I I feel a light fatigue in my leggies. Not right now. It's usually when I'm standing. If when I'm standing and walking. Yeah, so I don't think I slept very well at all last night. It didn't feel like I slept that badly, but damn. Apparently, I didn't get the rest I needed, so I feel it when I move them. All right, I am tired, though. I need to go to bed. I drank some water. That definitely helped. It would have been better if I could have started my day with some better food. I unfortunately didn't I, I didn't get to buy any more cereal. So, oh, sh I might need more milk, actually. But anyways, um... Oh, crap. I think I forgot to buy milk. I bought cereal today thinking, oh, good, I'll start my day well tomorrow. Guess what? I forgot the fucking milk. So now I can't even eat my cereal. Damn it, guys. Because today, you want to know what I started? You want to know what I had for breakfast? These. I had Skittles. I had Skittles for breakfast. Okay? Because I was like, mm, what else should I eat, guys? <laughs> I started my day with some Skittles. And I think tomorrow might be another forecast of Skittles. Because I don't, I have my good cereal and I was really excited because I was going to eat my good, I've got this really yummy peanut butter cereal. It's got protein in it. It's got fiber in it, you know, and then um, it's actually really good. It's the Kashi stuff. I don't know if you guys have ever tried Kashi cereal, um, but I like it. I've been eating that stuff recently, but damn it. I forgot the freaking milk. Motherfucker. What do I do? How do I do this? What could I do? I could just hit the drive through I guess. I could do the McChicken. I've been trying to like. Oh, I gotta I actually need to hit up the McChickens because this month is already almost done, which is crazy. 
All right. Randall, thank you for the follow. Uh, well, it was nice meeting you. Are you a simmer by chance? Because I have a lot of simming content for you. That would be amazing and true. That's literally the key to my heart, food. Okay. And pancakes? Mm, that's like yummy time. That's really yummy time. I love me some pancakes. I want to get some pancakes. I need some panty panty cakes. Waffles are good too. But I will definitely take your offer with pancakes. Whoops. Is this the... That's not what I wanted to do. Where is it? Camera only? Uh, I'm upside down again. Honestly, it looks better this way. It looks better this way. It's fine. I'll fix it tomorrow. So, well, that's okay, Randall. It was nice meeting you and having you on. But all right, guys, I'll be back on tomorrow. Have a great rest of your day, night, morning, wherever you may be. And I'll be back on tomorrow night, as long as I'm not super tired. But until then, I hope to see you guys sooner than later. Stay safe, stay healthy, and have a great night. Love your faces. Good night, everybody.